Right, uh, review number 16 is going to be the Mecha Monkey that arrived today. Yes, that's what I call him, the Mecha Monkey. He's a mechanical monkey. Okay, he's a gorilla, but still... Why don't you go correct those bastards also? Oh, truck not monkey! Mm. Anyway, there's an electronic gimmick, which you probably can't see at all. There you go. Give me a sec. Right, now that you can barely see me. Uh, bloody brilliant, I've got to find it too hard to mold a fucking missile. Anyway, uh. Yeah, three lights, one there, one there, and one down there. This middle one, behind his head, clear light piping lights up his brain. I shall fetch that. Oh, missile in a second. Let's open these curtains again, get some light. It's twice I've fired a missile and like gone somewhere. Anyway. He's got weapon storage for his... Um, on his back for his rifle that he uh, never used. Or did he? Don't think he did, he just used his titty gun. Pick that up. Yeah. Big Mecha Monkey! Shiny Mecha Monkey with a tampered name. Oh, yeah. Got a rub sign there on the back of his head. Of course he's a maximal, he's freaking optimus. Mm -hmm. But anyway, uh got the entire gum thing up there. Oh stick it down. Uh which mode am I going for? First. Uh I think I should do a repeat of hmm. Yeah, I'll just go to robot. But first there's these uh get in frame loop. There's these little buttons here, which I uh, push back, and it basically makes things go there. You know, it flies off and goes there. Everywhere. Oh yeah, there's a... Uh... Yeah. But yeah, that's his, uh... Beast mode. Well, that, that, that's his... Flash shield gimmick, which is uh, get the, these wing things down, which are yeah, these squeak as you move. But anyway, let's uh, open up his hands, rotate the thumbs down. Because you know he's going to be the other way round in robot mode. Uh, Um, rotate that up, expand these shoulders out, and, um, oh, oh yeah, yeah, and also sp spread them out. At the shoulder, so you can unpeg the chest, fold out these wheels, and then split them for rub mode, so you can fold this monkey head back, and you put it back, yep, that folds them like that, then you rotate these blue bits until a little hole there appears, so you can peg it in there, and then you fold the gun bit down, Lift up the cab, rotate the waist. The cab does open, actually. Yeah. That's pithy. Uh, and I don't think you do anything else with the legs. You don't really extend anything, not that much, but yeah, there's a. There's always a bitch to do. But yeah. Pull on this bit at the back. Yeah, this light gimmick. Uh, anyway, um, well, give me a second. Oh, 
Come on, you bastard. Obey me. I know I shouldn't really be using scissors, but... Right. Pop his head. There's like a peg here, which slides a thing below his head plate, which reveals sort of like another panel so that his eyes glow green. We have to shut the curtains here, but... But anyway, that's his robot mode. And this is his arm. And you can also sort of... Like in... Just like in the show! Uh, sort of arrange these blast shield things on his shoulders. There's one. Maybe you film these for a bit if you use a bolt nowadays, don't you? Well, I've since, uh... Yeah. Jolt was the only one... Uh, Jolt was the last one I did a one-off review. Yeah, I didn't do another one after it. That was the only review I did, uh, for... Cyberverse Sentinel Prime right after Roadbuster. Wings up. And there you have the giant mechanical monkey man and uh, uh, turn his arms and this as well. And to hold his gun, you just sort of put his fingers out like that and there's a see that peg? There's a hole in the handle there. Well it's not the handle, it's just the bit at the back. The stock I think it's Anyway, yeah. Uh, plug that in there. And there you go. So this little... Looks undersized on him, to be honest. But yeah, uh... Let's... Shut that curtain a bit, so... There. You can see it better there. He also comes with two spare missiles, which are there on his legs. But yeah, that's Optimal, Optimetal Optimus, and he is a big one. Seriously, I mean, shit. Now, I know a lot of fans were bombed out at the fact that he didn't just, like, come in to the show and just own people in various battles, but that's because he's overpowered. He's got the bloody power of a prime! Of course they don't need a... Uh, battles would be too easy in the show if he just came along and just owned everyone. Anyway, that's Optimal Optimus in robot mode. Not even facing the camera. Not even looking at the camera. Yeah, that, that, that doesn't peg in as far as I know. It just all rests there. No, nope, just rests there. But anyway, uh, I'm gonna, I guess, try and get him into vehicle mode. I mean, jet mode is fine, but there's always something wrong when it comes to jet uh, vehicle mode. Take these shield things off. Does he even have them in tank mode? Yes, he does. Got the box right there, so go on, wonky on me. Anyway, uh, hold that up. Wheels back together. I thought they were black, but no, they're sort of like a reddish brown. But anyway, let's have a go again. 
You know, I think I should actually look at the instructions in future, just, you know, just in case. Well, let's sort these on there. Bring the box over so I can look. Well, that's helpful. Ground assault, hypersonic attack, super robot. On. It's probably being very boring for the viewer. Get on. Right. Get that out of the way. There's the massive ass ground assault mode. Jesus. Oh, it's a big one. That is the ground assault mode then. Pick together. Just keep pick together. God damn it. Get damn it. That thing go in the bin. Don't worry, it's just cut. Anyway, uh, come on. There we go. Jet mode. Yeah. Jet mode of doom. Mm. But yeah, that's uh, Optimal Optimus. Whatever. He's a big one, though. Jesus. Ta da!